Hi Scrubs, I hope you're well. So we're back in Horse Riding Tales. I've got Orchid with me and we're just about to level the club up because we've been working pretty hard to collect points and it's time to level up and hopefully maybe get some more rewards. So we've got over 30,000 points, so we're going to go ahead and level up. Congratulations, your club has leveled up to level 8. So let's go ahead and see what level rewards we've received. Nothing for this one. That's disappointing. I kind of don't like that whenever we don't get anything. So over here, I have two brand new horses. And uh, I have, I believe it's the half Arabian over here. Yeah, half Arabian. Um, let's see if we can stable it. We can't. Okay, we need another rare stable. And then um, the Woodland Arabian as well. So they both need to go in stables within the next 12 hours. So we better go and make them some stables, I guess. So I have got one rare stable ready for one of these horses. But I'm having trouble placing the other stable. And I was asking you guys about it on the community page. So far, there has been no solution other than to buy it with gems, and I don't want to do that. But uh, we got the Woodland Arabian. We got this one out of the Bronze Whistle that we got for free for logging in so many consecutive days. And we got the uh, Half Arabian out of, I think it was a four-hour chest, from what I remember. Um, but I'll kind of show you guys what's kind of happening here. So I can put the Woodland Arabian into a stable. That works fine. The Half Arabian, I can't put in unless I spend gems. I'm gonna go get Clem here because I'll show you, I still have a space left. So if we go over here to the pet area, I went around all of the physical stables that are there in the game to try and find um, a space. And the only space I have left is this one up here, which you guys would have seen on the community page. When I click this and I click to craft a stable, it won't let me do it. And it doesn't make sense. I, I really don't understand why I'm limited. I mean, if I was to go and buy a whistle right now and get a really nice horse out of one of the big packs, what would happen if I can't put it in a stable? Would it disappear after, you know, 24 hours? That would really, really suck. So I have got enough Black Pearl saved up that we can go ahead and open another mystical pack uh, to try and get another fantasy pet. Don't know which one I want. Um, I want something that's not a duplicate and preferably a fantasy pet. What are we gonna get? Oh, we got the spirit bear. Okay, awesome, because that's one of the fantasy pets. So brilliant. Gosh, I'm gonna have to think of a good name for this one. Um, hmm. Okay, let's go ahead and get him here so that we can have a look at his skills and also give him a name as well. I'm trying to think of something kind of icy and snowy or something because I feel like that's what he kind of embodies. So I need to think of something. Right, I've called him Glacier. He has cold resistance. He also has the ability to swim at level 17. Strength at level 34. Dig at 51. 86 gives climb. And finally, 85 gives his predator. So a good amount of skills on him. I'm quite pleased with him. We'll have to train him up a little bit. So I decided to work on a daily quest and uh, get one of the chests for it. So we're going to go ahead and unlock this. Okay, we got some apples, gold, wood, iron, cotton, and a racing ticket. And I was hoping for a jam or some black pearls in there. So my club has got to the point where it can level up again. So we're going to level the club up and hopefully unlock a new reward. Congratulations, your club has leveled up to level 9. So what rewards do we get for level 9? Let's go have a look. Oh, we got another club space. And the next one we can get the tier 2 chest. Okay, I'm looking forward to that. We also get the club banner and the symphony shirt. So this should be pretty cool. I'm looking forward to seeing this. So I've decided to name this horse Lemongrass. It has beautiful green eyes. And um, I'm going to put the green uh, emerald fantasy set on this horse. Because I think it will suit the green tack quite well. So there's the saddle. We just need... Emerald Fantasy, and then we need the face mask. Oh wait, no, I already have the face mask. It's the leg wraps that I'm missing. That is what I'm missing. There they are. Okay. This horse looks really nice in that, actually. So, the stats for this horse before we take it out to ride. So this is obviously a rare, this Woodland Arabian. This was one that I got out of the bronze whistle that you get for a daily login reward. So, the stamina gain on this horse is 6. The traits are swift, calm, and sassy. 
Race jump is 11, control 6, and speed 6. So, let's ride Lemongrass outside here. Of the stable. See, where's the Parowatch? So this is a really nice horse. I really like this horse. It's pretty. It wouldn't have been one that I initially would have gone for, but you know what? Actually having it, it is actually quite a pretty horse. I do quite like this little horse. So I have some good news. I got my new tablet. Um, so I have now got a slightly higher render distance that I can put on so I can actually put it up to high if I want. Hold on, I'm just gonna click max because it's not. There we go. So we can actually see really far now in the game, although I'm not doing it all the time. Uh, especially when I race, I keep my render distance down a little bit lower, just because I think it looks a little bit better. Um, it can be a little bit laggy sometimes, but it's way better than it was on my phone, which was horrendous. So, now that we've had a sort of a little run around on uh, lemongrass here, so what I wanted to talk about briefly was the actual daily rewards here. So I got lemon from a bronze whistle, I think, last week. And the problem that I kind of have right now is if I get another horse from the bronze whistle, I can't put down a stable. And I feel like for buying horses in this game and... You know, if I was to go in right now and say I go into the shop and I decided to, I don't know, open a bunch of the horses out with summons, like, would I be able to even keep those horses because of the fact that there's like a lack of stables? Would I then have to buy more gems to buy more stables? Could I even place those stables? Because I don't even know actually if it would do that. And I don't want to get rid of any of my other horses because I'm very fond of all my horses. All of my horses are important to me. They've all been like different stages of my game um, and different points. And I really don't want to sell my starter horses like Violet, for example. I don't want to do it. So for anyone out there that has had this problem and you can say, oh, I did this and this is what happened. I would appreciate uh, your feedback on that. So in the daily login rewards, that's not the only thing I wanted to talk about. So whenever this first came out, uh, it was back in November, um, they made this change. And when we originally looked at these chests for the gems and the black pearls, I've noticed that they've been tweaking the percentages with this. And um, whenever we originally got the 4R chests, the time like back in November when I did that video, we got 2% chance of black pearls and a 3% chance of gems. And for the first couple of days, I almost got jams every day. Almost, okay? And then there was like three weeks, almost, I think, where I got none. Well, no, it wouldn't be three weeks, but it'd be like two and a half, I think. Yeah, about two and a half weeks, roughly, okay. Where I didn't get any jams. And then I got jams the first time last night again. They've really reduced that down a lot. I suppose they're working with it and they're trying to like work out like what works you know what is enough but not too much because obviously they still have to run this game like a business but i nearly would have preferred them to start out lower and then bring it up a little bit if it was too low um but i guess they're still working with it and kind of trying to tweak it because the 10 minute free chest is down to 0 0.5 the 10 minute ones used to be two percent chance of getting jams and then for the black pearls they've taken black pearls out of the 10 minute chest completely that's not an option anymore it used to be I've also noticed the ticket drops are less as well. Um, I'm getting much more in the way of resources for my island, really, with these. We'll go ahead and open these. I have another question. I, I keep remembering things. Is anyone else, sometimes when they come in here, even if you're a VIP, having to watch adverts to get your rewards? Because that's been happening to me, but it happens really randomly. Okay, we got a wood block, an iron. Oh, I literally said this, that I haven't got jams in ages. And I got gems last night and I got gems today. I'm going to have to eat my words now, aren't I? <laughs> that has not happened since last night for like, it was like two, yeah, two and a half weeks or so. So, because the first time whenever I was opening chests, I was like, oh my gosh, I'm getting so many gems. I love this. And then it kind of then reduced the rate, which I guess they needed to. And then we got some iron from the 10 minute chest. Okay. So right now, um, let's go have a look here. I do have a stable, 
that's over here. I'm going to clam for a moment, right? Let's go over here. So in the daily login rewards, I received a rare stable. So now I do have a stable here with no horse in it, right? I just crashed into the stable. Okay, back up a little bit, plan. So I now I can put a horse in this stable. This is the only empty stable that I own, okay? Now, if I was to remove the stable, I wouldn't be able to place it back down again still. And I did an I did a, like an experiment the other day. So from the daily login rewards, I got a common stable. And then I captured a common horse immediately afterwards, and then I tried to stable that common horse just to see. And if I get extra stables from login, like chests and stuff, I don't keep them because I've already reached the maximum amount of stables. So I am begging you, Foxy, please add more stables. Because there's like, there's loads of space for more stables, like around the game. There really, really is. Um, like we could have stables here in, oh, okay, there's a horse capture. <laughs> I immediately get distracted. Um, there are loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of areas that we could have stables added to. Loads of them. And I would really like if we could have more because I would at some point in the future like to open um, a couple of chests, um, you know, like the whistles. But if I don't have stables to put the horses in, I don't see how I can do it. So that is what I'm hoping for. Ooh, horse captures are giving double points right now for club. That's good. Um, so yeah, I, I really, really, that's what I'm hoping for right now, um, generally. I just really hope in an update soon we're going to get more stables because I feel like really there needs to be at least one stable available for every kind of horse we have in the game. Because if you're somebody that likes to collect all of the horses, I feel like that should be available to us. I mean, I don't mind paying a little bit more gold for stables that any horse can go into. I actually feel like that's something I really, really would love them to do because... If we like look at my stables right now, like all of my messy, messy stables, if I can turn lemon round here, right? So like obviously I have a common stable and then I have like some rares and epics and stuff like that. I would like to be able to buy a stable that any kind of horse could go into or upgrade it. I wouldn't care if it took like five days for it to finish. I just would really like the ability to upgrade stables that any horse type could go into. Um, because I feel like, at the minute, my stables are kind of a mismatch, like, look-wise. Okay, it does tell me what horses are in them, I guess. It does help. But then they already have the little name labels, so... I don't know, I just feel like I would kind of like something like that. Um, just more options. Maybe you guys have some ideas of what you'd like to see stable-wise. Are you running out of stables? Are you having this dilemma? Um... Because I feel like there's so many things that we could do. And I just really, really hope that we um, get more stables in some kind of area soon. But anyway, Scrubs, I'm going to leave it there. I hope you settle over there. And bye! -bye.